This is an 83-year-old patient who suffered a hyphema following a goniotomy. After a week, the hyphema showed no evidence of improving, and despite maximum medical therapy, the patient's pressure remained at approximately 30, and vision was at approximately 2200. The decision was therefore made to take the patient to the operating room to clear the hyphema and remove the clot which had formed in the inferior anterior chamber. The riskiest part of these procedures is often removing the clot from the endothelium. I like to perform this maneuver using visco dissection, and in this case I'm using the cohesive viscoelastic provis. With gentle visco dissection, collateral damage to the endothelial cells can be avoided, thus saving the patient the frustration of waiting for corneal edema to resolve. Once the clot is removed from the endothelium, similar visco dissection is done to separate it from the underlying iris. In this case, an organized fibrotic stalk can be seen extending from Schlem's canal where the bleed originated. With the clot now free except for the fibrotic stalk attaching it to Schlem's canal, the irrigation aspiration handpiece is used to remove the clot from the anterior chamber. Blood is removed from behind the eye well, leaving only a small amount left on the anterior vitreous space. The wounds are hydrated, followed by intracameral administration of antibiotic completing the case. I hope you found this video useful and thanks for watching.